Hi, everyone. Thanks for logging on to CBSDenver.com for a few extra minutes here with Broncos linebacker Shaq Barrett. And Shaq, I want to look ahead to Monday Night Football. Monday mm -hmm. night at home. What kind of environment is that? Oh, I guess the Chiefs is going to be, well, we only need to play the Chiefs, but our fans do a great job of making it a huge advantage for us. And it's going to, it's going to be high school for the Chiefs, and that's the way we like it. It's probably going to be a tough football game, come down to the last possession. Or we can just come out there and send a message and just beat them by 30. But <laughs> that'd be nice. But no, we're thinking it's going to be a grind out game. And yeah, we're ready to fight it out. I know you guys haven't really started game planning yet, but, but Patrick Mahomes, we've seen what he's doing yeah. so far this year. What do you see from him? Just the highlights and the numbers. Like, he's tearing defenses up. So we got to uh, really prepare for him this weekend. Uh, just do everything we can. Everybody do their job. We get pressure on them and make them uncomfortable back there and make it the worst game of his uh, season because he had all good ones so far. So he got to go down eventually and start with us. Now you've been with, since you've been with the Broncos for a while, you know Andy Reid, he gets creative with his play calling. Mm -hmm. How hard is it going up against a coach like that? What's the hardest thing about playing against Andy Reid? Nothing is straightforward. <laughs> like everything is a jet sweep of reverse or is it play actions and like, yeah. yeah. It works for them really well. They got the people, the personnel to make it work, the coach to uh, to put implement the system. So it, it's going to be, I, I like playing them though, but I hate playing their system, but I love playing against the Chiefs. So you look Monday night against the Chiefs, divisional game, I mean, doesn't get much big, bigger than this, especially coming off this loss. How important does this feel for you guys to just come out and get that win? Yeah, we, we actually started talking about it right after the game. Like we can't, we can't come out here like this next week. Monday night against the Chiefs, we can't, yeah, we can't let the season resemble last year, and we gotta uh, just keep improving, and we gotta start in practice this uh, this Wednesday so we could come out with the win. The, the emotions felt like the emotions got really hot in Baltimore, uh, and you may, maybe that's where some of the penalties were from, or maybe it's just because of such a hostile crowd. We know mm -hmm. it's gonna be emotional; it always is when you play the division. So, so now, how do you guys kind of go into Monday, planning to, I don't know, hone those emotions, use the energy the right way, I guess. Yeah, it's. It's always tough. You just got to uh, just do whatever you want to do in between the whistles. So when the whistle blows, just start. Then when it, when it uh, blow the end of play, just stop and just do it all over again the next play. That's how you got to pose your will on the guy in front of you and just just do whatever you want to do. And just he's just there as a defender. Like, you ain't really worrying about him. So if you do that, you would play a clean game, no fouls, no penalties. You might get one on that guy that you're going against if you just keep dominating the whole game. What's your favorite? Is it Sunday night, Monday night, Sunday afternoon? You got a favorite time to play? Uh, I think my favorite game to play, it might be a Thursday night game. Thursday night. Yeah, even though it's a short week, but I don't know. I just I like the Thursday night game a lot. Yes, I like that. All right, that's all the time we have here on CBSDenver.com. Shaq, thank you so much for joining us. Yeah, thanks for having me. We'll see you soon.